it's like right and wrong. I realized that there could be no such place as hell. You know, that you have a God that would send one of its creations into a lake of fire forever. You know, it's like, wait, now, wait, 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 wait. You told me God is love. You said that. The book said that. Oh, I love you enough that I'm going to fry your ass like an egg forever. <laughs> In hot grease, man. You see, that doesn't make any sense. Love is not that way. <clears throat> so I've got to ask the question. Which is true? After having the experience of pure, unadulterated love within myself, I understood that that could not be true. That what that was, I forget what you call the word, but what they're talking about is giving you an example of how you, the torment that you go through in your mind by not have come to the truth and not having come to love. Oh, an analogy. This is an analogy, I guess. Metaphor, Metaphor? yeah. <coughs> That's not the way that is. Oh. And then I began to realize, as I read more and more about, not necessarily the book, because I had read the Bible religiously. I was a Southern Baptist, and I had read that religiously ever since I was a little kid, because... Some of it was sexy, and some of it was like, well, wait a minute, let me figure out how to stay out of this lake of fire, and let me understand a bunch of stuff. So I began to read other things and see that, wait a minute, this is not literal. It means something else. So it was in asking the right question. In order to ask the right question, I have to question all sides. And when, I, when that answer comes together, I have to be able to accept that answer. Um, looking at something the other day where they had a couple on who practice, um, they're married to each other, but they sleep with other people. And I listened to the, what do you call the people who go one-to-one? -one? Huh? Monogamous? Yeah, the monogam mon monogamous people, I heard the fear in them. Oh, well, I couldn't do that. Well, nobody asked you to do that, okay? You are monogamous, then be monogamous. They are poly, whatever, yes. amorous. amorous, then that's up to them. I can't say Everyone should be the same way. Why? Because they're not. But that has nothing to do with me. So we have to ask the right question. Is that all right for them? Must be. Because that's the way they are. Should gay people get married? Why shouldn't they be as miserable as everybody else? 